I'm Laura and I'm here on a sunny evening in Edinburgh um, outside the assembly rooms on George Street where I've just seen the Shawshank Redemption. Now this is one of the biggest shows in the assembly rooms roster this year and it stars a couple of famous names, um, Omid Jalili and Ian Lavender. Um, and as you will know, it's an adaptation of the Stephen King um, novella, which obviously was most famously turned into a film. Big audience tonight, obviously a lot of high hopes, a lot of people who love the film, love Morgan Freeman's performance in it, and came really expecting good things, and I was one of them. Um, and unfortunately, I was really disappointed with the play. Um, I just found it quite stilted quite slow. I actually nearly nodded off at one point, although luckily the air conditioning was quite cold, so that kind of kept me awake. Some of the performances were good. I thought Omid Jalili did okay, considering, you know, it's quite a hard act to follow with Morgan Freeman, who obviously gave that part, the part of Red in the play. Morgan Freeman gave that part such a lot of gravitas. He's so well known in that role that obviously it's really difficult to take a part like that and make it your own. And I thought Omid, who does have a lot of experience, not just as a stand-up, but as a, an actor, a sort of straight actor, as we call it, um, he's been in several West End shows, he did well with that. Physically, he's sort of somewhere between Danny DeVito and Robert De Niro, but without quite the, uh, the gravitas of either of those actors, I'd say, or in fact the humour. He was strangely sort of slightly lifeless in this part. Overall, um, not really something that I would recommend. Um, I think you're probably better off sticking with the film or possibly even reading the novella and looking for life on the fringe elsewhere, really, because it's not going to be here. So obviously the Shawshank Redemption is one of a number of shows in Edinburgh this summer that are adaptations of really well-known films and books. So we'd like to know what's the best adaptation that you've ever seen on stage. Leave your comments in the comments box below and let us know. We're going to be uploading a new video every morning at 9am, so do subscribe to the I've Just Seen YouTube channel um, so you can get the best of what we're enjoying and not enjoying quite as much on the fringe this summer.